A terrifying experience for children this morning when their school bus went off a northern New Mexico road and crashed. The driver is dead. Six students are in the hospital. News 13's Gabrielle Burkhart spoke with some of those students. She is live in Ojo Caliente. Gabby? Nine students were on their way here to Mesa Vista School when their bus plummeted off the road down a steep embankment. Parents we spoke with are worried their kids are injured in more ways than one. Sky News 13 captured the aftermath of a school bus after it fell 30 yards down an embankment, carrying kids from ages 7 to 16. I hit my head on the bus. When I sat down, I was boom. And then I hit right there on my head. Seven-year-old Diego de Vargas was on board, released from the hospital with minor injuries. Police say the bus driver, 69-year-old Pat Valdez, is dead, but they're not sure if he had a heart attack or was killed in the crash. I also was told that uh, my grandson um, saw the driver fly out the window, so I'm sure all these kids are really afraid. Some of the older kids helped younger ones out the emergency exit. All nine were taken to the hospital. All of us went out through the back, except Derek. He he couldn't. He couldn't get out. Diego's nine-year-old friend Derek suffered a broken back. Derek's brother Xavier was also on the bus. All of a sudden, the bus comes off the road, and I just start holding onto the seat, so I wasn't hurt that much. And then I open my eyes, and my brother's on the floor, and he's hurt really bad. Varela's little brother was flown to an Albuquerque hospital. His older sister suffered from a broken jaw and had some front teeth knocked out. The kids released from the hospital have been through a lot. Are you um, scared to get back on the bus to go to school or you think you'll be okay? I think I'm scared. Mesa Vista did allow the students that were at school to go home today. Some of the students did stay and were told there will be grief counseling available for all students all week long. Back to you. All right, Gabby, the school superintendent says Mr. Valdez, the driver, is well known in the community, has driven school buses for years and never had a problem. Medical investigators will autopsy his body to determine how he died.